so today we are talking about one of my favorite makeup products lip and cheek tints you guys know i've been using lip and cheek tints for years now and i love trying new ones these are my current like top 5 that i'm currently obsessed with are you ready My first tint that I ever used and my like everlasting favorite is Benetint from Benefit. You can tell by the amount in this bottle it's almost over. Uh this is the original Benetint the rose tint which is the liquid um uh, tint now for those of you that don't know interesting fun fact about this this was actually made in the 1970s by the founders of uh, benefit for an exotic dancer for her nipples <laughs> to make them like pinker and uh, today it's like obviously a cult favorite and we've been using it for years now i remember this is something i tried first in my modeling days i keep coming back to it there's nothing like it in this world it lasts forever it's amazing It is slightly expensive. Uh it's about almost 2000 rupees in India which is expensive, but it's like you can just apply it on the go like this. You don't really need a mirror or nothing. And it's just really really light, you know. This is what I love about it. And that it's buildable. So as you can see really light, really watery and it just kind of instantly gives you a pinker rosier flushed look it's also amazing on your cheeks um i usually you guys have been seeing me for those of you that have been watching me for a decade you would have seen uh the crosses that i made on my face 10 years ago and i still make them and i just you know this is pretty much like the best blush around if you want that rosy flushed look um it's just something that looks great on anybody like i have not seen a single person that you know has not liked benetint for me at least everyone i've introduced them to has loved it and it's just worked wonders for me for me on my holidays this is a staple you can go into water so when you're swimming and stuff and you don't really want to wear makeup this is my go to i also throw on some balm throw on some lipstick to create new shades with this i mean you guys have seen this in i don't know at least over 100 videos it's one of my all time favorites and it's amazing and totally worth the price also they have a really tiny bottle as well so for those of you that are unsure and don't want to spend so much get the tiny bottle um try it use it once you're happy with it then invest in the bigger bottle the bigger bottle lasts a while like even for someone like me that uses it a lot so it is an investment and it looks amazing Up next we have another old time favorite that is uh, a little more affordable for those of you that want to try and experiment with tints. Now this is a tint I bought the first time when I went to Seoul which was about 4 or 5 years ago and uh, it wasn't available here at that time I still remember and I bought a whole pack with a lot of them and gifted it to all my friends. It gets extra marks for being so cute because it's like a little ice cream stick. And uh, in India I think they have four or five shades I'm not sure they have a lot more obviously in Korea. This is not as watery it's thicker if you look at it it has like a bit of a you know um like a lipsticky vibe but it's not really lipstick lipstick. Any apply it it definitely gives you more coverage. So the shade I'm using is OR205 and this is a more orangey uh, peachy tone which I kind of like. Now I'm not actually using this on my cheeks because I don't usually use a lot of my like tints on my cheeks anymore. Actually, I just use Benetton to be honest with you guys. Uh but of course this is a lip and cheek tint so you can use it on both. Uh what I like again about all these tints is they are buildable. The Best thing with tint is you use like put on one coat, let it dry. Don't keep layering it while it's wet. Okay, let it dry and then add another layer if you want it to be more potent. What do you guys think? Even though I don't use this on my cheek, I will show it to you guys so that if there's someone that is interested, you can kind of see what it looks like. The best part is you don't need any tools with tints. You can just use your fingers. uh this is definitely thicker than uh the 
Benetint. Again, you can just build it. Um, you can keep putting more, dry it, build it. This side has nothing. This side has something as you can see right now. Um, this is obviously an orangey shade, so it's not as poppy as a pink. But for me, like Benetint is like my go-to for my cheeks. Lips, I will still experiment with other stuff. As I said, this is much more affordable. It's 450 rupees and there's always a discount on Nike. I think right now it's about 400 rupees. This is the gel based tint. Uh, so it is thicker and it definitely has that gel like consistency when you apply it goes on really smoothly. Um, again, great to layer, great to wear as is. Comes in many shades and it's just super cute. Like you can pop this into your handbag and it, it I li like, like to have one in my handbag because it looks cute. <laughs> more than using it as a tint, it's just so cute. Up next, we have this one. This is the Peri Pera one that I bought uh, when I was in Singapore. Uh, you do get it here while I was looking for it. I will link it below like everything else. This is full K-drama vibes. Okay, if you want that like, you know, like that flash tint that they use, this is what you need. So instantly very potent okay so the shade i have is pretty orange pink like literally <laughs> that is the shade and um, i got this one because i like peachy orangey tones of course they have a zillion tones and apparently this is all available on amazon i didn't even know in india and it's pretty affordable so it's actually priced at about 690 and down to 500 and something you know on discount right now um, I was actually looking for more shades in this because I love the formulation. So it's much thicker than the others as you saw and it's more like a lipsticky, like a light lipstick tint, you know what I mean? Where it's not really drying for sure and it's got a velvety finish like as the name suggests. It's very smooth um, and instantly that pop registers like, you know, when you see them, like see a lot of Koreans in K-dramas, they have like that peachy pink lip with no makeup that's exactly what i've tried to achieve right now nothing else on my face just this and i really think this is one of the best affordable tints out there um really really potent looks really pretty and they have some amazing shades like they have got so many options like i'm just waiting to finish some of my tints so i can get like more of this then we have Flora Tint by Benefit. Now, Benefit actually has a lot more tints than Benetint. Benetint is just like the basic rose tint. Then they have uh, Cha Cha, they have uh, Posy, they have many, many, many tints. I've actually just picked the ones that I really use and like a lot. Flora Tint is another one that I really like. This is Desert Rose um, is the shade name. So this is definitely much more darker and it's like a nice dirty pink, which is what I love about it. It's not uh, you know, like a pretty, pretty pink like the other pinks. It's a nice dirty pink, but it looks really, really pretty even when you wear it with your uh, Indian clothes. I use this a lot as a layer under my lipsticks. When I do like even a nude over this, it looks really, really pretty. Of all the tints that Benefit has after Benetton, I think this is definitely my favorite. And again, you could just wear it as is. It's just a really, really pretty shade as you can see. Last but definitely not the least is one of my current favorite favorite tints. It is the Etude House Water uh, Dear Darling Tint. Now this is the shade orange I think. I'm being literal here because the color is orange but I think yeah it is the shade orange. Um, it comes in okay and I think three or four shades. This is I remember saying this is Benefit Ki Sasti Behen in Sasti Behen I think or was it the other one? Uh, but it really really looks and feels very similar. It's more watery than Benetint, I feel, uh, but it's again very pigmented. You can see the orange is really, really potent. And I love this shade. So of course they have pink like Benetint and if you're looking for a cheaper version, I would say, you know, you should definitely try this. But uh, for me, the orange is a winner because I haven't found this shade in any other water-based tint and it just looks amazing as is or to layer again. So I love to add my lip balm over this to get like uh, my favorite thing about tints is creating your own lip shades, okay? So any of these tints, you put them first, you let them dry, then you put on like a lighter lipstick, like a nude, a light pink or a lip balm and it'll give you an all new shade and that is what I pretty much do. So a lot of times people are like, what is your lipstick shade? I don't really have a shade that I can give you because it's a mix of two or three things. But I love, love, love this as is, like look at it. Now this is also 450 rupees, but it's always on discount. I think it's about 400 rupees. So yeah, massive price difference between like Benetint and this, but uh, both are really good. I do feel like Benetint lasts a very long time and the pink one is really, really pigmented and the 
like just the flashiness that gives you on your cheeks is like no other for me but i love this one too so guys these were my current top 5 uh, lip and cheek tints as i said i mostly use them for my lips i only pretty much use benetton on my cheeks but i am a complete tint girl i love experimenting with tints comment below with your favorite tints as well uh, anything you haven't seen me use or mention not just in this video but otherwise as well and i would love to try new tints so peachy orangey pink is my vibe and uh, i'm open to suggestions comment below so if you like the video give it a thumbs up and as i said comment below with your favorite tints for me to try and maybe do an updated video with your favorite tints next time see you guys bye